Okay, uh, I'm here on behalf of the Maine Composite Alliance and the Maine Wind Supply Chain Consortium, which is a consortium of industry and academic sectors in support of Maine's offshore wind industry. Um, a new technology has been developed in Maine uh, that could give Maine a leg up in terms of competing to supply components to the supply chain for offshore wind energy. So the consortium is organized with the Maine Composite Alliance, which is a nonprofit, as the lead in partnership with the Maine Advanced Technology and Engineering Center, which is the composite center operated by Southern Maine Community College, and a series of companies including uh, Broadreach Technologies, which is a joint venture of three Maine composite companies, to take a technology that has been developed in Maine and in collaboration with the Deep Sea Wind Consortium, which is the consortium led by the University of Maine to develop offshore wind, to take a specific technology and adapt it to that project. Uh, the technology itself is called temperature controlled molding. It appears this month on the front of Composites yeah. Technology. That's a main product on the cover. Brand new technology being rolled out as we speak in Las Vegas at the American Composite Manufacturers Association. The consortium is a consortium of private industry and the training to take this technology, adapt it for offshore wind blades, and make it available to main companies. We need uh, funding, federal funding for it because it's very experimental, but it is a, it involves already existing consortium members with deep sea wind. Thank you. At two minutes.